additional questions about what we do. That makes sense, right? Okay. What happen is, if eight vehicles come, we'll let next point. That, that makes sense? You can fuel at 130 something degrees, but you're not going to go full 22. On here, it'll tell you exactly what port you want to evacuate. The UBO closed, V2 closed. If you don't want to pull that out, it's good. Enough. Minus 23. So you guys are one degree colder. <laughs> I'm Captain James West Ballard, HHC Commander of the Division Special Troops Battalion in the Division Sustainment Brigade. Okay, so here we're at ADC Champion. Uh, my, as the HHC Commander, I provide mare cell and base defense operations for the Brigade TOT Cluster. Within the Brigade, brigade TOT Cluster, we have the Brigade Staff, which is the DSB. We also have a Battalion Staff, which is the Division Special Troops Battalion where both of those organizations operate to provide mission command and uninterrupted logistics planning for the rest of the brigade. Hello, my name is Sergeant First Class Mendoza, platoon sergeant for Alpha Company 194 DSSB. Today with our Rock Combined Army training, we did our MFS system, our M978, and our M969 fuel tanker capabilities, and also we did our PQASI. With the combined training, we can improve the interoperability between the ROC and the United States Army. It was such a great experience today. We'll always fight together and fight tonight. Kapchi Kapchi Da. I'm Captain Paul, Alpha Company Supply Company Commanders, 194 DSSB, 2ID Suspension Brigade. So this is a great opportunity to train champions and the ROC 5th LSB team and verify interoperability of both U.S. ROC equipment. So we continue to master logistical support on the unfamiliar Korean Peninsula terrain and make the training more realistic and dynamic. And the state of this combined training, we gained confidence that we could provide logistical support rapidly under any circumstance. We will continue to solidify the tactical rock US alliance. Fight tonight, we go together. Kachikapshita. 
I'm 2nd Lieutenant Hodgson. I am the bulk platoon leader, Alpha Company 194th DSSB. What you see out here is a culmination of two months of planning and training, providing water purification, fuel assets, fuel points, and logistical support for our maneuvering companies. What? And one of the tenets of a professional army is the ability for logistical assets to synchronize with our maneuvering units. And if, if we can do that, then we'll be prepared to fight tonight. We go together, kapsi kapsi da. Oh, yeah, okay. Greetings, I'm Captain Johnson with the 194th DSSB SPO. Currently, I work as the DSSB Deputy SPO. We are here today at ADC Champion to provide logistical support with the ROC Army. We're training together as a team to provide the interoperabilities amongst ourselves. This training includes fuel, water, and maintenance. This is to increase our ability to fight tonight. Kapshi, Kapshida. My name is Warren Officer One Samuel Opong. I'm a 923 Alpha representing 194th DSSB. Uh, as you can see here today, we had the opportunity to conduct combined training, combined water training with our rock counterparts from 191st uh, Engineer Battalion. And you know, this training is really important. We need to keep working together to you know, increase our interoperability with our water systems, you know, because water is life and we need that to sustain the fight. Uh, 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 it makes us happy that we continue to get this opportunity in keeping the fight tonight mentality. Uh, we, we fight together, we go together, so we appreciate our leadership for always encouraging this type of combined training, you know, to increase our tactical and technical proficiency. Second Lieutenant Anthony Davis, I'm the water platoon leader for Alpha Company, 194th DSSB. Today we're out here training with uh, our counterparts in the ROC Army on some combined water uh, field training. Um, we're just going over the essentials of transportation, distribution, and purification of water. And it gives us an opportunity to see the, um, the capabilities of our counterparts and then better prepare us to fight tonight.